Mike, I wish I could deliver this weather faster to you. We're going to be in it the next couple of hours. It's headed in your direction, and I know it'll be a nice break for you getting wind gusts to 101 on your own handheld anemometer. Impressive. Yeah, and I think the winds right now, where we are, are even higher than that. So, so this is this is starting to be taken very, very seriously. Now we're getting some, some new wind reports there, Steph, out of Hobby at 78 miles an hour. So uh, we've definitely got uh, hurricane winds here in the Houston, Texas area. And certainly what it's going to do is going to knock out power. It's potentially going to knock out power to millions of people. So uh, Centerpoint and Entergy, they are going to have a heck of a job on their hands here uh, once this system clears and you're going to try to get millions of people back online again uh, that's for sure we're thinking now that maybe within a half hour or so we're going to see the eye right here in clear lake which is in southeast houston take a look at this incredible 3d image that we get courtesy of the trim spacecraft that is operated by nasa it takes uh, visible and microwave imagery from space and it's got a bead on Ike right now and absolutely stunning imagery coming in and you can see distinctly where the eye wall is and where the eye is. Uh, that's just beautiful uh, imagery from NASA so big thanks to them uh, uh, for getting uh, for allowing us to get that on air. Nonetheless the worst of it is occurring for us right now but Adam and Rich uh, I mean we're thinking here that, that soon we're going to see some calmer conditions with that eye moving in so we're keeping our fingers crossed for that. All right, let's show you some. Uh, let's show you some the live pictures right now. Another location here in Clear Lake, and again, the thing about this is, the winds are over 100 miles an hour, gusting over 100 miles an hour right now. And I want you to to imagine being out of that, and maybe being hit with a piece of debris. Imagine this: Nolan Ryan, the Hall of Fame pitcher, could throw a fastball at 100 miles an hour. Imagine standing out there and letting Nolan Ryan hit you with a fastball. That is not something you'd want to happen. So this is truly amazing what Ike is dishing out right now. This is the worst that we've seen, obviously, uh, for the past two hours or so since we've been here in Houston the past two days. Uh, the problem about this is, my goodness. I mean, really, this is is mind-blowing what we're witnessing right now and being able to broadcast to you live is i have never witnessed anything like this in my career the, the kind of winds and the kind of rain that we're seeing uh with hurricane ike right now and nonetheless we're going to continue to keep you updated here uh, and any new reports that we get in although uh communication a little sketchy right now we'll certainly pass those along so uh that's the latest here from uh, clear lake in southeast houston we're going to send it back to you in the studio yeah, you're seeing all that wind there, clear at Lake Texas. Rich, this is amazing. You don't know if that's a snowstorm or what. The visibility, incredible. And as they pan away a little bit, you can see some of those palm trees just blowing back and forth. And uh, Mike Bettis was talking a little earlier. He actually has one of those handheld anemometers clocking a wind there of over 100 miles per hour. He actually had, said he had to get down on his knees to actually hold the anemometer and now it doesn't work anymore. So that just shows you the power and fury of this system. And he's still feeling that northern eye wall for maybe at least another hour or two before things begin to calm down. Yeah, let's have a look at the radar and you can see uh, exactly where Mike is with the uh, Clear Lake. Yeah, we're gonna go over to Clear Lake. You can see it right there and he is in a band, one of those, the northwestern part of the eye wall right there. That is southeast of Houston. 